Welcome back. You ready to paint a fantastic little painting today? Well, all right, let's get started. So first things first, we're going to have him graphically run all the colors that you need to paint this painting along with me today, starting in order with the white going all the way around the palette. Now I've already gone ahead and prepared the canvas with a thin, even coat of the liquid white that makes it slick and ready and, and, and it just makes it fantastic. So with that said, let's get started. Now I'm going to come right in here to the to the thalo blue and just and just mix it right into your brush. Just right into your brush. Just dab it right in. Nice even coat. Dapping it makes it nice and and, and molecularly sound in the bristles. And we're just gonna come right up in here and we're just gonna do little crisscross strokes. Nice even little crisscross strokes. Now, we're gonna start with a nice even coat of the Thalo Blue. Nice little crisscross pattern, starting at the top and working our way down. Now we do the crisscross patterns at the top because we want the edges darker. We want it darker on the edges than we do at the bottom. So we're gonna start at the top and we're gonna slowly just work our way down. There we go, there we go. There we go, nice even coat. Isn't that a fantastic way to make a, a happy little sky? Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. And we're just going to take a clean, dry brush. And we're just going to and we're just going to blend over that now. Yeah. 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 Nice even sky. Now, now what's a what's a nice little sky? without a happy little cloud. But first, we gotta wash our brush. So I'm gonna come in and, as you know, we, we wash our brush with the odorless paint thinner. Just dab it in there and, and just beat the devil out of it. That's the funnest part of painting. That's my favorite part. So now I think we're gonna go into the, to the liquid white and just need a little bit on your brush. And we're gonna paint us just a, a happy little cloud. And we paint these clouds by just adding little circles. Just little tiny circles. Now. Now you don't want to stay in one spot too long, otherwise you end up with big cotton balls. And that's not what we're looking for. So we're just doing tiny little circles, working our way down. There we go. Nice, nice. Now, we want, once again, we wash our brush in the odorless center, beat it off, and, and of course beat the devil out of it. Now with the clean dry brush, we want to come to the bottom and just blend. There we go, just, just take the dry brush and just blend the bottoms out. There we go. We just want to blend this cloud. Oh yeah, perfect. Perfect. And with that dirty brush, we're going to go right back into the thalo blue and just take a, a tiny little bit of the thalo green. There we go. Thalo green, tiniest little bit of the thalo blue. There you go. And we're just going to come in here and do little, little crisscross strokes. Yeah, starting at the bottom, the thickest part, working into the middle. Into the middle. And we'll come back over to this side too. And we'll do this side. Yeah, just nice, even straight line all the way across. Now you want to make sure that, that you're leaving this middle part open. That's going to be our reflection. And you don't want to start in the middle and pull out because that will give you this ugly little brush stroke. And that's not what we want. So we'll start from the outside. There you go. Pull in. Pull in. And we're looking for this nice little shimmer of light here in the middle. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, that looks nice. Yeah, that looks nice. And we'll come back into the old little thinner. Tap it off. And of course beat the devil out of that. That's, I look for any excuse to clean my brush. Now we're just gonna kinda fade this out a little bit. Yeah, just kinda fade it out. Great, great. Now we're gonna come back in. We're gonna take, we're gonna take our small knife. Where's my small knife? Now we're gonna come into the midnight black. Just take a little bit on the palette, just a little bit of knife, cut off that little itty bitty roll of paint. Get that little bit of roll of paint. And we're gonna come in here and we're gonna paint ourselves a happy little mountain. We're just gonna come in here and kinda just drag ourselves out a happy little mountain. Now all we're worried about is that outside edge. Don't worry about this bottom part. We don't care about that. All we're worried about is that crisp line on that outside edge. So once we got that outside edge, we'll come back to our miniature motherfucking brush and we'll just blend it out. We'll just begin blending it. There you go, see that? Start blocking in the shape of our mountain. 
Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of brushing that out. Yeah, that looks nice. Yeah. And now we have ourselves a happy little mountain. Now with the same with the same knife, I'm gonna come back under my palette. I'm gonna take just a tad, take yourself some of the liquid white, pull it flat, and just cut it. See that? Just cut it right across the canvas. Just a tiny little roll of paint. And we're gonna come back in here and just paint ourselves some happy little snow. Yeah. Yeah, very light, light as a feather. Now when I used to teach painting, I used to tell them, paint like a whisper. Think of yourself like a whisper floating across the breeze. Just shh, don't even fucking say anything. That's what you want to be. So we're just going to take the knife, just going to drag it across. Oh, oh, that's pretty. That looks good. And now we have our highlight color. So now we need a shadow color. So we're going to come back into our white, just take a little bit of the white, and a little tiny bit of the phthalo blue. And we're just going to mix them right here on the palette, right there. Pull a little strip out the phthalo blue mixed with the white and now we have a shadow color and we're just gonna cut the same way thin tiny little roll of paint see that little roll of paint and we're gonna come back in we're gonna paint us a happy little shadow color just zoom 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 see that oh oh that's pretty oh that looks pretty and now we have ourselves a happy little shadow color so now I think we're ready to to move on and, and paint ourselves some some little trees. So we're gonna go back to our tiny miniaturized, tiny little brush, and we're gonna go right into the to the Van Dyke Brown. So we're gonna take some of that Van Dyke Brown, just pull it right out, just tap it, just mix it right on the brush. Maybe a little bit of the white too. And we're gonna paint ourselves some distant little trees. Now, now we just wanna brush these on real lightly. These are background trees. We don't we don't want a whole lot of detail in these trees. We just wanna have indications. We're just trying to paint indications. We don't really want to see too much going on here. These are background trees. They don't have many detail. We're not going to put in any color. Yeah. Yeah, that looks nice. That looks good. So with that same brush, I'm going to come back in. And I'm going to put the same color, the Van Dyke Brown. I'm going to take that same Van Dyke Brown. We're going to go right back into the liquid black. We're just gonna pull the black. There we go. Yeah, nice and easy. Load it up. There we go. Nice and loaded. And we're gonna come back in here and we're gonna paint us just a, a happy little, happy little island looking thing, right? Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Now we're gonna. That looks good. We're just gonna paint us a happy little island. Yeah. So now we're going to paint some happy little reflections, and we paint these reflections by pulling down. Just pull down. Yeah, there we go. Just add a little indication of reflections in the water. So now we're going to, what's, what's happy little ground without some happy little grass? So with that same brush, we're going to come right into the, to the sap green. Yeah, just go in and, and just dab it. Take some of the, a little bit of the sap yellow and the sap green, and just, just dab it right there in the brush. Just mix it right there in the brush. Yeah, and if your paint's too thick, add more paint thinner. So here we go, we're gonna come back in. Oh yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna tap. Oh, I need a little bit more paint thinner. We're just gonna take a little bit more. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, just add some happy little green. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's pretty. Maybe just a tad bit of the yellow too. Need some of that yellow in there. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's pretty. Now that yellow really helps accent that green. You really need those highlight colors. And we paint our darks first, because you can't have lights without the darks. We need that dark for the highlight color to show. Without that dark, we're not having any highlights. So now that we got our happy little forest, I think we're gonna put maybe a happy little tree in there. So we'll come, we'll come right back into the to the alizarin crimson. And we'll take maybe a little bit of the phthalo blue, maybe some of the phthalo black, and we'll just. Mix it right here on the palette. We're just looking for a real dark color. Maybe a little bit more of the, the phthalo green. There we go. Oh, that's pretty. And we're just gonna come in here and we're just gonna tap it out. There you go. There you go. We're just gonna tap ourselves out a little tree. Maybe he lives right there. I don't know. We don't know. Does anybody know? 
I don't know. We're just going to have ourselves a little tree. Just going to come right back in here. We're just going to tap in just that happy little tree. There we go. Yeah, we don't know where he lives. We don't care. We don't care where he lives. He's a tree. He grows wherever the hell he wants. He's happy. He, did, he, he wants to grow there. Fuck it. He's going there. So, with that said, we're going to go in. We're going to clean the brush. And we're going to come right back in. Oh, I think we're going to... Uh, what do you think? Should we have like a little piece of ground right there? I think so. The, the, the ground gets lonely next to the water. So we're going to come back in and take some more of the, the Van Dyke brown and just mix it on the brush. Yeah, just mix it right there on the brush. Yeah, just mix it. So I think we'll come back in and just zoom, zoom, zingo. Yep, up, oh, it's done. There we go. And maybe over here, same thing. Zoom, zing, zoom, pew, up. Oh. Get a little bit more color. And if you don't make those noises, it doesn't work. You try painting, you don't make those noises, it just won't work. So there we go. I think I think that looks good. It's kind of green, it's kind of dark. And and we'll just come back right in, wash the brush, and we'll come right back into that yellow. Yeah, just tap. Just tap. Just tap it right into that yellow. Yeah. And we'll take some of that yellow. And we'll take some of that yellow and we'll just add ourselves a couple little pieces of highlight right on that ground. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Now, that ground, it seems kind of lonely right there without, without something being there. So so maybe, just maybe, we'll come back in. We'll take some more of a alizarin crimson. We'll come into the Van Dyke brown, some of the black, some of the phthalo blue. We're just looking for a, for a real dark color at this point. Just real dark and we'll dip our we'll dip our paintbrush back into the paint thinner to, to thin our paint out if you're having problems with it sticking add more paint thinner or some of the liquid white we're gonna paint a big tree and maybe he lives i don't know right here zoom he does now and we're just gonna clean that up and maybe add a little footsie right there and oh oh that's pretty so we'll take that same brush and we'll clean it off and come right in back into our titanium white the titanium white we're gonna we're gonna paint some happy some happy little uh, things at the bottom here just give it like little indications of, of light at the bottom of the trunk oh that's pretty oh that's pretty so what do we need now I think what's our happy tree with us some happy little highlights we're gonna take our, our small knife and we're gonna take the, the titanium white and we're gonna paint a thin even piece and just cut ourselves off a tiny little roll of paint and we're just gonna come in and highlight this just just barely touch it yeah just barely touch it now the canvas pulls off what it wants and it leaves you with what it wants sometimes that's nothing sometimes it's everything we don't know if you have a problem again with it sticking add at least a little bit of paint then that'll really help help it stick so we'll just there you go just tap it on oh oh that's pretty and now we have ourselves a pretty little highlight so now we're gonna need some some bushes for our tree and what's a tree without its leaves right he's just a dead old tree so we're gonna come back into that liquid into that liquid white and pull a little bit of the into the into the cadmium yellow a little bit of the sap green Ooh, ooh, that's a pretty color and just tap now we're just tapping a thin even coat on our bristles and we're just gonna come back in here and we're just gonna Tap in some leaves. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I like that. That's pretty. And maybe we'll come back in and and, and don't be afraid to, to really beat it in. Really beat that color in. Don't be scared of that color. Don't be scared of the paint. Just tap in some more highlights. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice. That looks nice. And you know what? I think with that, I think we'll have ourselves a, a finished painting. And we're just going to go ahead and sign it down here at the bottom. Yeah, we're just going to sign it there. And with that said, I, I think we have ourselves a finished painting. I really hope you've all enjoyed it. Take care. God bless.